The International Olympic Committee, IOC, has urged sports bodies to ban Russian and Belarusian athletes and officials from international competitions following the invasion of Ukraine, the organization announced Monday, amid increasing numbers of national teams and associations refusing to host EVE. Paralympics The International Paralympic Committee is set to meet Wednesday to discuss Russia's invasion of Ukraine and Belarus assistance. The Beijing Winter Games are set to start on Friday. The IOC previously denounced Russia's invasion of Ukraine amid the Beijing Olympic and Paralympic Games as a violation of the Olympic truce. The truce, which all 193 UN member states, Russia included, agreed to uphold, calls for the cessation of hostilities during the Games and for a short period after they conclude. It dates back to the very beginning of the Olympics movement and serves to promote peace and ensure athletes safe passage to the Games, though it is non-binding and there are no formal consequences for breaking it. The IOC is the latest in a multitude of sporting figures to condemn the invasion of Ukraine. Teams and organizations have distanced themselves from Russian sponsors, national teams have refused to play against Russian competitors and organizations like UEFA and Formula One have decided against hosting events in Russia. FIFA, the world's governing body for soccer, is reportedly set to suspend Russia on Monday. The organizing body faced backlash for deciding the national squad must compete upcoming games in neutral territory, threatening to derail the upcoming World Cup as other national teams including England, Poland and Sweden refused to play Russia. FIFA takes stand against Russia, here's how the sports world has reacted to the Ukraine invasion, Forbes with Ukraine under attack, the sports world cuts ties with Russian sponsors, Forbes, IOC strongly condemns Russia for violating Olympic truce by invading Ukraine, Forbes, 